Large white heated galls is also known as Larus genus. The genus contains 24 species. Large white heated calves are also known as Larus genus. Larus is a large genus of calves with worldwide distribution or by far the greatest species diversity is in the northern hemisphere. Many of its species are abundant and well-known birds in their ranges. Until about 2005 to 2007, most gulls were placed in this genus, but this arrangement is now known to be polythelitic, leading to the resurrection of the genera Exelietas, Crovicocephalus, Nocophius, and Hydrocolois. This last had been recognized more often than the other genera, for several species traditionally included in Laros. They are in general medium to large birds, typically gray or white, often with black markings on their heads and wings. They have stout, longish bills and webbed feet. The taxonomy of the large gulls in the herring and lesser backpack complex is very complicated, with different authorities recognizing between two and eight species. The genus Larus was introduced in 1758 by the Swedish naturalist Carl Linnaeus in the 10th edition of his Systema Natura. The genus name is from ancient Greek Larus or in Latin Larus, which appears to have referred to a gull or other large seabird. The genus contains 24 species. In Australia, the common name is Pacific. In the Pacific coast of South America, it is called Vulture's Call. In Atlantic coast of Southern Brazil, Uruguay, and Northern Argentina, the common name is All Rogue's Call. In coastline of East China Sea, Japan, Manchuria, and in Kuril Islands to Alaska and North America, it is called Black Cod and many others. The circumpolar group of Larus gall species has often been cited as a classic example of the ring species. The range of these gulls forms a ring around the North Pole. The European herring gull, which lives primarily in Great Britain and Northern Europe, can hybridize with the American herring gull living in North Africa, which can also interbreed with the Vega or East Serbian gull. The western subspecies of which Pirola's gull can hybridize with Hogland's gull which in turn can interbreed with Siberian lesser blackback gull. All four of these live across the north of Siberia. The last in the eastern representative of the lesser black gulls back northwestern Europe, including Great Britain. However, the lesser blackback 
calls on the herring call are sufficiently different that they rarely interbreed. The group of the calls forms a continuum except in Europe, where the two lineages meet. However, a recent genetic study has shown that this example has far more complicated than presented here and probably does not constitute a true ring species. Swans are birds of the family and today within the genus Cygnus. The swans' closest relatives include the geese and ducks. Swans are grouped with the closely related geese in the subfamily and Serenae, where they form in the tribe Zignini. Sometimes they are considered as fami subfamily Zignini. There are six living and many extinct species of swan. There is a species known as the Kuskoroba swan, which is no longer considered one of the true swans. The northern hemisphere species of swan have pure white plumage, but the southern hemisphere species are mixed black and white. The Australian black swan, Cygnus atratus, is completely black except for the white flight feathers on its wings. The cheeks of the black swans are lightly gray. In South America, black neck swan has a white body with black neck. Swans are generally found in temperate environments, rarely occurring in the trop tropics. A group of swans is called a BV or a wedge in flight. Four or five species occur in the northern hemisphere. One species is found in Australia, one extinct species was found in New Zealand and the Chatham Islands, and one species is distributed in southern South America. Say you again in my next video. Bye.